Welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome to Allegra Gardening. And up. I'm your man up today. Let's do a little short video on what we got going on right here. I just want to show you my oranges and my hibiscus. This is my hibiscus, bis hibiscus right here. They made the hibiscus tea out of. You see, I got a lot, so I'm gonna be able doing a whole lot of plucking. But mine, I seen some videos. Some people already got this. They taking them off already. But mine's haven't done anything yet. They're just growing taller and taller and taller. But I seen one around the corner here that has a little callus on it. But for the most part, let's see can I find it. It has a callus that's coming on it. But most of it is just big, big plant. Let me see if I can find it. It's around here somewhere, y'all. Let's see. Uh... Right here, we got one. Right there. We can focus in. Focus in. Right there. I got one coming in. But the rest of them like they don't anything yet right now. Well, it's, it's, some, it's a couple more starting to form a little bit. They're starting to form. I haven't looked at them that close. Why he showed them to me? He had a couple of them that started to form. So it's about time they start to form. They've been in the ground since like May. May the 1st. Here it is, October the what? I don't know, the 8th or 9th. But what I want to show you was my Satsuma. Satsuma orange tree. Look at that, y'all. Almost ready. The Satsumas are almost ready, y'all. Getting that golden orange yellow color to them. Another week. This little tree is loaded. They will be ready. Ready to consume. I already picked my limes off my little lime tree right there, there in the house. I just want to show y'all this orange tree right here. Nice oranges. This little tree. It's been in the ground. This is second year in the ground. And as you can see, I got tie wraps holding it up. Tie wrap there. Because I don't want it to break. This little tree bearing all this fruit right here. There's about 30 pieces on here. But yeah, I just wanted to show y'all that today what we had going on with that citrus fruit. So you can grow citrus too in your area. We in zone 8A, Virginia. And you can do it too. If I can grow it in Virginia, I'm sure you can grow it where you at. Just had to cover it up during the winter time, put a little cover on it. You put a little one of the little jackets over top of it. Put you like the little iridescent Christmas lights around it to keep it warm. Once you grow it, get down below 20 degrees. And you can grow you some stuff too. Because I cover them up when you get down to about 20. During the night, during the daytime, I take it off no matter what temperature it is and put it back on if it's still cold. If it's above 20 degrees, I don't cover it up at all. I just leave it. Let it do what it do. And right now, it's doing. It's a nice orange. So, alligator garden up. Put your uh, Hawari Satsuma tree in the ground. Very cold hearted orange tree. And grow yourself some oranges. Until next time, alligator garden up.